What's going on guys, it's Omniarch, and today I'm bringing you a brand new video talking about promoting your channel. And real quick, before we get into that, I just want to say the worst possible thing, the most frustrating and annoying thing that any YouTuber can go through is recording an entire video and being really happy with how it came out and then finding out that for some reason your computer decided to use the wrong microphone input and then the audio sounds like complete garbage. So here we are we're redoing this i was about to go edit the video and here we have to just film the whole thing again this video would have been out days ago if it weren't for that um but yeah so anyway let's talk about you know promoting your channel because there's there's a lot of different uh ways to do that and i i, I feel like there's two schools of thought and two like rivaling opinions on how you should promote your channel um, and how you should basically grow on YouTube. So I've wanted to make this video for a very long time. And the reason for that is because I actually have an auto message on Twitter. I don't know if you guys know this. I've mentioned it in the past. Maybe you guys are only here because you saw my auto message on Twitter uh, or something like that. And a lot of times I get really hateful messages. People sending me messages like kill yourself, fuck off, uh, like, you know, just the worst possible, like cancerous shit on the internet. People just absolutely hate when they get an auto message from some youtubers and you know uh the the reasoning behind this is because you know a lot of times they say well you know if your content is good uh people will like it and people will share it and you'll grow organically you know they, they think that um you know if you're promoting your channel on twitter or on on instagram or anywhere uh that your channel must be shit uh because you're actually trying to promote it instead of it growing organically and and that's one of the, that's like the biggest uh you know school of thought i guess uh, that a lot of youtubers have or a lot of smaller youtubers have is that you know um you shouldn't be you know quote unquote spamming uh people or begging people for subscribers or views or anything like that uh, you know, if your content is good, people will come. That, that's basically their entire philosophy. I, on the other hand, think that that's complete bullshit. And I know that it makes sense, right? It makes sense on paper. If you have a really good quality video, uh, someone's going to watch it and they'll think, oh my God, so-and-so would actually really like this video. Let me send it to them on Facebook or let me, you know, tweet them a, a, a link to the video and say, hey, check out this video. And that makes sense on paper. The problem that I have with this method is that YouTube and especially the gaming scene is so saturated with so many people and the way that the YouTube search results uh, you know rank videos is based on views and subscribers so there's a very good chance that even if you put out a really good video you put a lot of time and effort into it you're not going to get anybody watching that video without promoting yourself in some form on some platform or social media or telling people about it telling your friends or anything that there's just there's so many people on YouTube it's such a huge massive platform and there's so many people that even with good content uh, the odds of you growing organically these days are really not that high and there's going to be you know obviously some exceptions to that rule one big example is grade a under a I know he's talked about how he got big on YouTube he said that somebody on reddit uh, liked one of his earlier videos and posted it on reddit and it got a ton of upvotes people really liked it and he kind of blew up from there uh, and obviously you know he does put out you know good quality uh, funny sort of ranty videos and he does deserve in my opinion the amount of success that he has on YouTube so there's going to be situations like that where yeah you know someone does share the video and you do get really popular off of it but that is a very specific small chance you know that doesn't really happen all the time it doesn't happen every day uh, it doesn't even happen every week you know there's there's just too many people on YouTube competing for views and things like that to where growing organically is is just you can't bank on it you can't just sit around and wait uh, for somebody to share your video or for someone bigger to notice you you know uh, that's just the, the, there's just too many people doing YouTube at the time so some people might say okay I'm New York I understand I see where you're coming from I get it you know the platform is big but that doesn't mean you have to beg people for views and I totally agree my auto message basically just says hey look I know that you hate auto messages but if you want you can check out my channel it doesn't say subscribe it doesn't say follow me on twitch and, and are on Twitter it doesn't ask for anything all it does is link my channel and say if you want check on my channel I'm not begging for views I'm not asking for subscribers I'm not asking for anything because that's stupid and I know that's dumb you can't beg people to do something for you because it looks desperate and it looks like yeah you look unprofessional you know um, 
But I think promoting yourself and begging for views are two totally different things. And I think promoting yourself is incredibly important in 2016 and beyond uh, for growing a YouTube channel and a YouTube brand, you know, um, and the reason for this, and this is the big thing, this is what I don't understand with, you know, a lot of these people that say drink, bleach, kill yourself when they get my auto message. I'm basically just kind of advertising. That's pretty much what it is. You know, I'm kind of just getting the word out about my channel, my brand and what I do here on YouTube, you know, and I don't understand where these people come from, where they think that advertising is the devil. Um, you know, every single service, every single product, every single company has an advertising budget and they purchase ad space everywhere on the internet in newspapers magazines television uh you know on mobile apps even on like the top banner there's ads everywhere every company every whether it's a respectable company or some sketchy shady internet marketer everybody promotes their products and this is super important you know my degree i'm going to be completely transparent with you guys i i'm a business major and i go to school for marketing okay um it's just what I like to do. I find it interesting and I enjoy it, you know, and I don't think that promoting yourself is sketchy. I don't think it's uh, begging. I don't think any of that is true because, you know, how would you know about all of these amazing products that you already know about without some form of advertisement? You know, people like to think that they're not influenced by ads, but they actually are. You know, if you prefer Coke over Pepsi or if you prefer Tide detergent or something, you know, you probably saw some sort of commercial about it or something or your friend might have told you about it, but they only bought it because they saw a commercial about it, you know. So there's commercials and there's ads for every single product out there, even like the most well-respected uh, well-loved companies still promote their products they still have ads uh, and they still are kind of just getting the word out about what they're doing for me personally I think you're shooting yourself in the foot if you're not trying to take advantage of social media and promoting yourself the same way that literally every other company and every other service or anything uh, promotes what they do or what they have or what they're selling or whatever by me following people on Twitter who also like Call of Duty or video games Games in general and asking them hey can you know if you want you can check on my channel I'm a youtuber I'm trying to grow etc etc you know that's just me kind of advertising my brand and I don't think there's anything wrong with that you know and and the, the best part is that it actually is working you know my channel is growing uh, I have taken a, a few weeks off here I, you know I needed a break for just for personal reasons uh, I just wasn't feeling the YouTube thing and I'm trying to get back into it um, so I haven't seen growth lately obviously because of that but um, overall, my channel has been growing for the for months now. It's been growing because of me kind of just getting the word out about what I'm doing here on Twitter and the people that you know tell me to drink bleach and kill myself. Uh, those people have eight subscribers. 10 subscribers you know they have very small channels uh, and I know that they're trying to grow in the way that they think is you know uh, respectable I guess and that makes total sense and you can do however you want um, but all I'm saying is if I'm gonna put time and energy and effort into making videos and trying to entertain you guys or maybe spark thought or have a discussion in the comments you know um, I want people to watch I want people to see what I'm doing and know that I'm here and I'm making content and I'm trying to be entertaining and I want to you know grow my audience and I think that promoting yourself in a reasonable way on Twitter or Instagram or snapchat or Facebook or wherever I think that's totally reasonable I don't think that's uh, you know like view whoring or whatever or you know begging for people to subscribe to you so I just wanted to make this video kind of talking about you know the two ways that people think about advertising their YouTube channel one people one type of person thinks it's complete cancer and the other like myself thinks it's totally reasonable because everybody does it every you know every company every you know every individual everybody has ads everybody is trying to promote their product um, you know, like I said, it's it's not just youtubers, you know, you, you see ads for every single thing out there You might not even know about your favorite video games if it weren't for um, You know a commercial or you wouldn't know about You know your favorites whatever it could be anything but there's always ads for everything uh, And I think that it's not uh, I don't think there's anything wrong with promoting yourself on YouTube and I think and I encourage you if you have a YouTube channel and you're trying to grow look into ways that you can promote yourself on YouTube and I think that you're going to be excited and I think that you're going to like the results that you get uh, just do it in a way that's not 
you know, cancerous or, or, or rude or anything. Just, you know, just get your name out there. Get your name out there. Who, who's, how are you going to grow if nobody knows who you are, you know? Uh, that's, that's my philosophy. I want everyone to know who I am. That way I can actually grow on this platform. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you drop a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, just refresh the video and uh, give it another chance. Uh, and then after that, maybe you'll like it and you'll drop that thumbs up. If not, drop a thumbs down. I'd rather you drop a thumbs down than not do anything at all. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one and comment down below telling me your favorite, um, Tell me what your favorite car is. Tell me what your dream car is. If you tell me what your dream car is, I'll know that you made it all the way to the end of the video and you're the real MVPs, you're the true homies. Uh, and also, obviously, comment down below telling me your thoughts and opinions on what I talked about here today in the video. I would love to hear your opinions and if there's anything that I missed or any points that you think I should take into consideration, definitely let me know in the comments and that's about it, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed and I will talk to you guys later. This has been Omniarch and I'm out. Peace.